All right, guys, please excuse the ice cream man in the background, but I'm going to be explaining to you guys what's going to happen. As you guys already know, I said as I came back from my trip from Texas, I love the look, but I get I have to get rid of the red. I know it was 50-50. You know, half of you guys want me to get rid of it, and half of you guys don't. Um, I'm stuck in between I do and I don't either, but my interior is going to go to a good cause. I'll be explaining right now. Yes, I'm going to be getting rid of all this red, like I said. If you guys, if you guys were saying that you guys wanted me to do it, that's for you guys. And for those of you who didn't want me to get rid of it, don't worry, guys. Um, I know what I'm doing. Let's trust the process. I'm sure you guys are going to love the truck as soon as it comes out the shop. So we're going to be getting rid of all this red interior, but it's going to be going on to my boy Fernando's truck. Here it is. Check it out. Yes, he's an SA Trucks as well. So that's why it's perfect, you know. Check it out. I'm going to be getting this interior. This is a stock one that my truck actually came with as well. So if you guys don't know, my truck basically looked like this before the red. But what's happening is we're going to trade. And then um, all of this, I'm going to be rewrapping this with my boy Backyard Custom Interiors, a new color. I can't tell you guys the color yet, but it's going to be a surprise. So basically, bye bye to the red interior, but it's going to go on my boy's truck, which is going to look super clean. And yeah, right now we're going to record the process of switching it. Check it out. This is where we're at right now. We got rid of all the trims right here on the outside. Driver, passenger seat, and the side panels. And check it out. That's my Titan window. I'll be showing you guys the work there. And look, guys, I didn't really realize it since the seats were on. But look at this mess that, that was in here. But right before we install anything new, we're going to give this truck a nice cleanup. But basically, guys, everything that we've done so far is the easiest part. And look at all this mess from the system. We're going to get that... Uh, taking care of as well make it look nice and neat but check it out guys so far this is the easy part um the door panel should be easy too this one and this one will be easy those are next this is going to be the only hard part the dash but you guys know me i'm going to freaking do nothing's too impossible for us so we're going to be doing that as well and these are all the parts so far i'm going to miss this red guys i know you guys too but let's trust the process you guys are going to love my new interior and this is going to look fire on my boy's truck so it's a win-win for both of us
Alright guys, so check it out Ya le quitamos casi todo, la deshuesamos como dicen mis papás um, this middle seat I'm gonna be keeping because my homie has the older one and obviously that wasn't included and same thing with the dash She said he doesn't really like it anyways So we're just gonna be rewrapping these as well, you know, so that's not a big problem for us But check it out guys. Look at this whole mess. Literally. It looks like a freaking truck que encuentras in a junkyard Literally took everything apart guys. Everything's out We couldn't finish his so tomorrow morning He should be here so we could uh, remove his and then start putting everything back on mine Like I always tell you guys you gotta trust the process, you know Se mira espantoso, pero está fácil. Alright guys, so check it out. We removed all my boys' old parts, ready for me to rewrap and check it out. All finished up with this interior, guys. It looks freaking amazing. I'm gonna miss you, red interior. You treated me so well. But it's time for something new. Check it out, guys. Everything fit perfect. Like I said, we're not gonna be doing the middle seat. But other than that, everything's done, guys. Look at that. So we're still going to keep seeing this interior on the vlogs, but like I said guys, don't worry. I'm going to rewrap this and you guys are going to love it. Alright guys, so we're pulling up right now to where we're going to be buying the new door panels. We're going to check them out and I guess the owner has them at a storage. Oh, we're going to go check them out. A ver qué. Oh, ¿también tiene clusters? clusters? Sí. ¿No tiene uno de una Escalade, por casualidad? Sí, sí, Cool. Alright guys, so check it out. These are the old panels. As you can see, um, they have right here the hole and this is where, the, where they're manual and they go like that. And when you wrap them, you can still see this hole and this bump. So that's what I don't like about it and that's why I decided to buy the new ones. I want to show you guys the difference. These are the factory electric ones. Look at this. These come with this um, thing where you could grab it too to get out and stuff like that and to close the door. And then they have the actual buttons right here. Not like my old red interior where I got them done aftermarket and they put the buttons right here and it was just an aftermarket button. So look at the difference, guy. Could you guys tell? I'm not worried about the color. The color doesn't matter because they're gonna be wrapped. But I just think these OEM ones are gonna be perfect for my truck. And they're gonna look badass, guys, with this handle. I'm gonna color match it. And these original locks that come from the factory. All right, guys, so we just pulled up to my compa backyard's new shop. And I say new shop because if you guys didn't know, uh, he used to work for his house. And that's why his name was Backyard Customs. It's basically like backyard means house, you know. Pero gracias a Dios, everything's working out for my boy, and I'm glad it is. I like it, the business keeps going up for him. So now he's able to get his own shop here in San Bernardino where he lives, which is amazing. I'm proud of him. He has a truck kind of like the one I just bought my parents. But he used to have a job first and then he got tired of it and then he lifted it and then he got tired and now he chopped it back but it's freaking static like swallow god just like literally it's on the ground it's goals for my parents truck i'm gonna show you guys his truck and his new shop get out there's my truck throw a chueca because i can't park Ahí está la de mi boy. look at this damn this is goals guys for my parents truck imagine this Right. 
and I don't know whose truck this is. I think it's a customer's. I think they're gonna be finishing it up as well. It's just badass. This is a new shop, guys. Look, they've been working on somebody's truck, which is pretty sick. What's up? Aquí estamos con mi compa Lalo, aquí está mi compa Backyard helping me choose the right color. And check it out, aquí tenemos, le robé todos los libros because, you know, we want to get the perfect match. Tenemos starting from suede, we have leather, we even have cocodrilo, como las botas de mi jefe. Yeah, ostrich. Yeah, ostrich. Yeah, guys, but check it out, look at all this book full of, full of colors, and they're all badass. Look at it. Where's the pink? The pink is what we're going to go with. Yeah, guys, there's so many cutters to choose from. This is the hardest part. We're trying to match it. Check it out, we have the book. But yeah, guys, basically right now, we're going to choose the color. Okay, guys, so that's going to be it for this vlog. I think I found the perfect color. Right before we continue with the process, I want to hear your guys' opinion. I want to see what color do you guys think, what color do you guys recommend. I bet, you know, so because I'm going to take that into consideration. So fill up the comment section of what color interior you guys think I should go with next. Guys, please do me that favor and smash the like button. If you're new to my channel, hit that subscribe button and become a Jerry Ticker today. And I'll see you guys in my next vlog. Peace.